We're setting up specific standards for specific MOSs based on the needs of the MOS. And now it's setting up those standards and then not changing those standards, not relaxing those standards for any group. And if you meet the standards, if you can do the job, then gender ought to be irrelevant. Nobody wants to do anything that would in any way lower the combat effectiveness, lower the readiness of the Marine Corps. We have the greatest expeditionary fighting force in history. It's part of our job to keep it that way, and this initiative, I think, is going to strengthen that.